Hi all. I wanted to talk with you about about a list of all religions and belief systems. So this one the next one is called Rastafarian well you just call Rastafarian continuing on from previous previous religion titles from part 10 but this is part 11 so it yeah so what it what it says here is is that Rastafarian is a, is spelled R A S T A, so that's spelled sorry, R A S T A F A R I A N, Rastafarian. It doesn't even say Rastafarianism, but it just says Rastafarian, and it's it's a, it's a god that's um that's called it's a god that's called Jah like a like a black jesus in a majuna and do they do majuna rituals but so it says about being a that that he followed the black jesus so we i'm just thinking which part would would uh would 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 Rastafarian or the leader or the or the God be the God Jah being being the Black Jesus? So I've seen f photos of it before, but if you if we look at Jesus, there can only be really one Jesus as I as I, as I understand it, because. If what I do is as well, I will I will give you the description of 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 I uh, uh, not give you here's the audio in brief of the of the god named Jar. But bear with me, I don't know how good the sound is going to be on this. So hopefully you can hear it. But if you can't hear me, if you can't hear it, then just let me know. So here it is. One moment, all. Marcus Garvey. In the 1920s, he founded the largest ever Pan-African organization to redress the historical injustices caused by colonialism. Marcus Garvey's His emphasis was on self-help, a new black civilization, and a partial return to Africa. Garvey won global support from the black working class. So when he prophesied a black king would be crowned to liberate the African diaspora, some of his Jamaican supporters took this to mean the 1930 coronation of Haile Selassie as the emperor of Ethiopia. A preacher called Leonard Howe was a member of Garvey's organization and he believed Emperor Haile Selassie was the black messiah returned to earth, known as Jah. Howe set up a religious commune to worship him, an alternative living space that rejected colonial rule. The movement was called Rastafari, combining Selassie's title and birth name. Yep. So, where are we? So yeah, that's that's the description of of or roughly rough description of Jar. But I need to listen to it again to explain it. So in the audio it talks about Jah being a messiah. But if we look up or or and and uh, and compare it to what I've read out to you so far of of Jah being God God like or the black Jesus and the Messiah with the audio with the audio I've said 
if if we look at the meaning of Messiah, this is number one. Well, Messiah is spelled M E. Yeah, M E S S I A H. Number one. It the it the it says here in number one. There's two. There's two here, but it's no, this is number one. It says the the promised deliverer of the Jewish nation prophesied in the Hebrew Bible. And it says here, number two, a leader regarded as the savior of a particular country, comma, group, comma, or cause. Okay. Um, yeah, so that's, that's what it means to be a messiah. It talks about the Jews instead of Rastafarian. And yeah, I don't know what else I can say. I think I think you have to go by your own understanding of what God is God God has revealed to you uh, who who is Messiah and who is God and who is the real the real Jesus. Go by what God reveals to you personally in prayer as well. Because God speaks through prayer and obviously plead the blood of Jesus, plead, plead the blood of Jesus in it as well. Sorry, not the blood of Jesus, but just plead, just plead Jesus on it as well. Don't really need to put plead the blood of Jesus on it. Just it's just Jesus, it's just Jesus alone. So if I go. Not there. So I'll move on. I think I don't think I can find anything else to talk about about Rastafarian. So the next one. It's it's called Ravidasia, Ravidasia, which is spelled R A V I D A S S I A, and it is it's about souls about the divine and proper living uh to 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 be able to realize to be able to realize god but you can't really real be realized through your soul only only if you pray and seek god through that and and obviously obviously find 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 jesus our lord and savior but you know you you could say you know jesus jesus is not the only answer but you can try you can try in this religion ravidiasa or any other religion of of the parts i've mentioned from part one from part one to part 15 or where, wherever i end it you can try searching all of those individual 15 well those many religions and try and find try and find and realize God but if you end in Jesus you'll find that it's only Jesus the Bible speaking Jesus from the Bible speaking or God from the Bible speaking so that's the only way we'll realize God not not just only by our souls because our, our souls our souls are like uh, like our communications with with the world our spirit is our communications with God so the soul is the soul is carnal and it contains the spirit so you can't with the soul you can't really realize God only our only our own selfish sinful nature sinful natures it's only the spirit that can realize God and realize God 
God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. So moving on to to this one, which need which really needs no introduction. But if I mention the name, you guys, you, most some of you, most of you, all Christians will know them. And not, but and some unbelievers might know them as well. So it's called Salvation Army. Salvation Army, which is spelled S A L V A T I O N. And then army a r m y, and it's it's a Christian organization. Evangelists organized along military lines, famous for charity work. Um, yeah, it's it's based purely about about Christianity and and, and helping an Indian, supporting the local community in in their in the area in the local area. I don't. I don't really go there really much. I know there's one near nearby where I live, but uh, but apart from that, I don't really go there because I know they're doing their own thing, and I know people donate to them, and you can donate to them even t even now and in the future until Jesus returns. But I don't believe they'll. I don't believe they'll end because like the like the good. All the new Bible says upon this rock, Jesus says, Jesus says upon this, upon this, upon this rock, I will build my church and the gates of Hades will not prevail against it. That's the Hades as in the, the gates of hell, the gates of the devil, the gates of the devil, it and its minions, Satan, everything opposing God. Going, go, taking, taking a stance against God. So let me move on. So this one, Santeria. It's spelled S A N T E R I A. Santeria. That's I spell it again S A N T E R I A. It's it's a it's a it's a it's a it's a mixture of West African Caribbean beliefs and a bit of Roman Catholic Roman Catholic Catholic Catholicism Catholicism in 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 it. So yeah, so it's you could some might even think it's it's to do with Catholics because it is Catholic Catholic Catholics is Catholic. Catholic Catholicism. So yeah, and this one, last but not least, well, yeah, least in 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 in, in evil. Uh, well, more, and prominent in evil, I should say. Is is called Satanism. S A T A N I S M. Is. It can be the least of our problems, but it's the big, but it's a big deal to, to, it's a big deal for crime, it's a big deal for Christians not not to ignore Satanism. So it says it's a. It's talking about Satan is not a not a real being, just a symbol. I don't believe that's true. Um, Satan is not a symbol. Satan is actually a demonic, demon, a demonic entity. And and it's also it just talks about it, it it being an atheist religion that uses dark symbols, and and it's and it's anti-religious, and it's got anti-religious purposes. So yeah, so I spell you Satanism. It's spelled S A T A N I S M. We we as individuals should re shouldn't really dab dabble with the dem demonic because it can breed in breed in breed in our lives and enter into our lives and bodies all sorts of problems and and it can kill us. It can kill us. It can not it can not just kill us. It can 
he can kill, steal, destroy our lives, and and our whole, on a whole entity of what we what we are meant to be as human beings. Our, our rep, all, all of our rep, representations as human beings, and and give us disfigurement in our in our situations and circumstances, and it sucks 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 our lives away. Satanism. Uh, even you know any and say every, any time the devil speaks, he speaks a curse on our lives. When any time God speaks, God speaks the bl a blessing in our lives. Even if it's just, even if it's just for twenty seconds or seven or even six six seconds six six seconds, God speaks. God God still has a blessing in that six seconds or five seconds, or even in that emotion that God still speaks. Whereas the devil is there to curse and to kill and destroy our lives and destroy our li livelihoods. You know, if anyone tells you any different, that it's, that it's a blessing to be with the devil or to serve him or it. They, 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 I, I wouldn't be surprised if, if, they, if they worship Satan. I wouldn't be surprised if they worship Satan themselves or, 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 linked, or linked with some kind of rock rock music or something link linking with other other stuff in that rock music or something like that so yeah it, it, i mean some people some 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 rock music don't really don't really heavy don't don't really heavily go against don't don't really go against you know people human beings but some some of them some of them can do but as far as I know, I don't, I don't really know of any really pure rock music. I haven't really heard, I haven't really heard of any. I would love someone to prove me wrong, and I will, and I'll, and I'll, yeah. So. That's really all I have to say in this video. So. I will. I would love to love you guys and pray for you guys and gals and yeah. Let me just pray. Um, Heavenly Father, thank you for your grace and mercy you put upon us from past, present, and future. Oh God, we plead the blood of Jesus Christ on the situation, on the situation, on these situations. Oh God, our circumstances in our in our bodies. Oh God, if we are bound up, oh God, free us, Father, in Jesus' name. We plead the blood of Jesus Christ on the situation. Pray nothing can fall upon our situation. Pray grace and mercy will be upon our situation. Pray heal us right now, Father, in Jesus' name. We plead the blood of Jesus Christ in our situation. Pray not to fall upon that. Pray heal us, Father, by, by grace and mercy and power in Christ Jesus. Father, pray you free us, Father, in our minds, hearts, bodies, Father. Help us to feel different in the in these in, in these prayer times, Father. In Jesus' name. We pray your your your, your glory will shine upon us, O oh God, in Jesus' name. We plead the blood of Jesus' name. Pray your you minister unto us in our minds and hearts, Father. Heal our minds and hearts, O God. Heal our minds and bodies, Father. In Jesus' name, we pray your your anointing will fall upon us for restoring us to re restoring us and restoring our circumstances, Father. In this original form, O God, please forgive us for our sins, Father, and all of our sins. Help us, Father, to forgive one another, O God. Even if anyone's wronged us, O Lord, help us to forgive one another. Father, because that's that's when the healing comes. Only when when we forgive one another, that's when the healing comes. But without without not without without un, without unforgiveness, Father, there there can be no there can be no healings, oh God. But we pray, Father, help us to 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 to, to muscle up the courage and strength and humbleness to be able to, to forgive one another, oh God, and forgive ourselves, Father. We plead the blood of Jesus Christ in that situation. Pray, don't you fall upon that, that situation. Pray you meet with us at a point of need, O oh God. Not a point of, not at a point of want, but on, but only a point of need, O oh God. We plead the blood of Jesus Christ in the situation. Pray not to fall upon that. We pray these things all in Jesus' name. We pray, Amen. God bless you guys and gals. Bye for now. Peace be with you. If you can't, and my last words, if you can't find peace in your circumstances or situations, then really sit down, think hard and carefully what your ambitions what you what you want to do with your lives or what, what ambitions you want to follow and do because sometimes when we when we're frustrated with something 
or 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 fed up with something. It's sometimes it's not. Sometimes it's just. Sometimes it's, sometimes it's not even the job that's the problem or the circumstance or the situations. Sometimes we we we're in a misplaced calling in our in our in our in our lives. We're 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 at a place that we're not meant to be at, and we've got to we we've got to seek God and declare Jesus Jesus our Lord. I was we got to sorry we got to declare Jesus as our personal Lord and Savior, and then that's where we can find our true callings. If we try to find it anywhere else, we won't find it. But I can only recommend and encourage you to seek seek God, seek Jesus. Jesus is your personal Lord and Savior, and then that's when you will fulfill your true calling whatever it might be. So God bless. Bye for now. Peace be with you.